everybody. My name is Sarah Jane Grant. I am the director of LXA in the Middle East. Um, we are a team of 90 industry experts ranging, um, ranging across the globe from London to Manchester to Dubai to Bangalore and more recently and excitingly here in Riyadh. Um, we have, uh, we do um, everything from project management through to interior design, design management and we've changed dramatically over the last, um, over the last year. And we've done that in many, many ways, but there are two particular ways that we feel that's important to share with you today. One of the big changes that we've noticed is um, that our business has become more collaborative. Collaboration is huge in what we do, and we think it's an important part of our growth. And one of those uh, collaboration opportunities has been with our competitors, who we no longer see as competitors, we see them as an opportunity. Um, and by that I mean we see them as collaborators. Um, over the, um, sorry I can't see this now. Um, so we, what we've been doing is we've been identifying the strengths of our team and what we're good at and looking at our competitors and working on what they're good at and working together to offer a much better solution to our clients. And that's great because in this industry, we, uh, in this part of the world, we're growing so fast, projects are getting bigger, we're growing and we need to be better for our clients. And by working with our partners and no longer seeing them as competitors, we've been able to maximise um, the opportunities there. And the second way that we've seen ourselves really leading and changing our business is by embracing the Gen Z. Our workforce has, uh, average age has dropped quite dramatically. We're embracing these new people. They bring us new energy. They've brought us new ways of doing things. And what's happening now is, is like a reverse mentorship situation where we are learning dramatically from the new skill sets and the new ways of working from our new team. Um, we've done that and, and with them brings the, the benefit of technology um, and, and ways of using technology which you know is, has been fascinating. One example of that might be that we're currently working on the iconic Hotel Atlantis here in du uh, over there in Dubai um, and we've been able to harness the expertise of specific skill sets that help us with the water park and we're able to do that through technology meaning that we don't have to fly those people over and we can um, have better skills for our team and so how has that developed into change well we've grown by 275 percent here in the region which is huge growth for us um, our, our project values has grown we've gone from um, we've grown by 170 uh, 175 percent in terms of our project um, capabilities there which is fantastic we have a highly vo uh, motivated team um, that are ready to work and supporting our business and believe that they're buying into something very very exciting um, yeah, so come and join us. We, we, we're an exciting team and we're looking to, to, for teamwork. And if you've got something to offer, we'd like to work with you. <laughs> Mic drop. <laughs> Absolutely fantastic. Thank you, Sarah. Um, I love the idea of reverse mentorship as well. Gentlemen, your questions. Absolutely. So reverse mentorship was, was substantial. Uh, but an important point is you work across the globe. You work in smaller markets and larger markets. Reverse mentorship in terms of not just your skill, your own workers, but in terms of local partners who, who, who understand the local sort of uh, nuances of, of, of local cultures, how have you been working with them? Yeah, I mean, we, we're lucky enough to have been here for 14 years, so our understanding of this market is better. And what we've been able to do is we've been able to enable maybe um, specialist consultants from all around the world to come and work in the region and support the growth of this region by uh, and, and making LXA the enabler to do that. So you're bringing specialists from around the world. What about the homegrown specialists? How have you enhanced them and how have you enabled them? Well, actually, um, it, it's, it's, it's counterproductive. Um, we've, got a, we've got a project currently at the moment where the project is so big, we weren't going to be able to service that in the way we'd like to. So that project has now, we've now worked with the people that were competitors, um, interior designers, that specialise, that, that do those jobs better than we did. And we had to look quite internally and say to ourselves, right, are we, are we the best person to design this project? Or are we the pers person to enable another company to design at that level because they have that expertise of creativity, harness it and deliver it in a way that's suitable for our specific, specific local partners? So. Excellent. Very humble. Excellent. Very good. Thank you. Um, Sarah, that is your two questions. Thank you so much for your contribution.